this is a recording tell you how to publish the dashboard scripts to the shiny app but first you need to install the R studio and have all the packages that you need ready for the dashboard yeah and connect to the make sure you connect to the development branch and go to the dashboard folder that you want to publish in this case like for example so this is the dex project folder and we click dashboard and if you um, we use the development dashboard as an example we enter the folder so every folder actually there all the files are, are the same but the scripts in in them may be different and you have to enter the right folder to publish the <coughs> the right to um because each folder is connected to the exact link for example the uh, development dashboard is connected to development um link yeah pattern is pro for production test is for test dashboard <coughs> so if you want to you want to publish the de development you enter development and dash um dashboard folder and there are two files which is are, are really important the ui the r and server the r these are for the for the uh, dashboard uh, dashboard apps so if you click so ui is for user interface on dashboard uh, you don't need to worry about that so let, let's close this yeah that's ui and this is folder so for any scripts you want to change you and um, how it works like how you query it how you um um, do the analytics or display the function and um, functions you add it here in your server All right, so you can run the app as long as you have everything ready so make sure you have the scripts ready so make sure there's no bugs and the data in the data set that is that the dashboard is query from for example like the yeah the development dashboard new analytics make sure they're up to date yeah, if the scripts, if the data is not up to date, for example, we are using where when user choose the weekly or daily, which is a short time interval period, they it will give bugs. So make sure the data is up to date, and that's how the date filter in the dashboard codes are working. And so as long as you have everything ready, you run for the first time, run app, click here. Yeah, you show the dashboard here. <clears throat> so it take a while. You can see the code is running here. That is querying the data. And zero bytes because I I run before, so it's already in my the data is already in my laptop, so it's actually querying nothing. But this is the process. Now we have the, all the data, uh, the data dashboard we want, and just. Briefly check, and if no problem, you close it, and you stop the app, you stop it, and publish. Publish is the icon here. Click here, not click here. If you click here, oh, either way is okay. Just click here, and you, it will give you. Yeah, so this is connect to update. It says update. Yeah, connect to the development, and you just click publish. So it's taking uh, around five minutes. Yeah, that's it. Hope it helps. Bye.